Hey YouTube, got another lock for you. This is the Brinks Model 165 uh, combination lock. It's a uh, four digit combination lock. Uh, I believe they market this one as uh, sports lockers, things like that. Nice metal body, uh, resettable combination with this lever right here. And in this particular one, the combination is set to zero, 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 zero. So, uh, the one thing about this lock that I don't like is that it's extremely easy to decode with uh, the Peterson mini knife. See the combination set to zero, 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 zero. We're going to flip it over, put it into combination change mode, if I can get that uh, little lever up there. go combination change mode mix that combination up to something I don't know make sure it's all in and put that lever back there we go mix it up again and now I have no idea what the combination is so the way we decode this you just take the Peterson mini knife, stick it in the top of the wheel on the left hand side. And we start rotating each wheel until we feel the mini knife go down into the gate. There are no false gates in this. But, yep, there it went. It just went right down in the gate. It probably was not real easy for you to see, but it is extremely easy to feel. We'll just do that on the next. Oh, there it is there. See, this is not taking very long at all, is it? Oh, there it went there. All right, so the numbers that showed up are show the camera 7159. I don't know if that's visible in the camera. That is not the combination, however. Once you get all the gates lined up, you have to spin the wheels four digits to the left. So seven, eight, nine, zero, one. And then one would become five, 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 comes nine, and then nine becomes three. One, five, nine, three. And there it is. It's that simple to decode these things using the uh, Peterson mini knife or even an aluminum soda can. If you just cut an aluminum soda can and get a simple profile on it it doesn't take much you stick it uh, down in the top of the the wheels and spin them you'll see what i mean you can feel it and you can decode these things in a matter of seconds so the brinks uh, 165 combination lock it's a cool little lock and yeah it might be okay for you know at locking stuff up at the gym where people aren't going to be messing with your lockers but as you can see uh, don't trust it for anything of value that's all i've got for you have a great one.